as you can see we've got some rather long grass and uh, weeds to get down um, this particular place I used to cut the grass um, haven't done quite a while now uh, got an agreement with them I only come in as and when to do the hedges and shrubs um, somebody else is going to be cutting the grass and the weeds but uh, for one reason or another hasn't been done for these six weeks so it's down to me to try and get it all cut one of the dangers in this particular garden is there's a lot of stones uh, basically because there's a lot of rabbit holes and the far side near the fence line is quite bad um, they're proper ankle breakers so it's, you've got to be careful on this one uh, sort of runs along that far side along the fence line there this side isn't so bad the grass is it doesn't look it actually on camera it's probably about six inches high um, but as you'll see in a bit the far side that's probably near three feet um, I'm, there's some patches that are quite weedy and I know on, someone's going to say I'll, sh I'll just trimmed them first but um, to be honest with you I think if I'd strimmed them, they lay flat on the ground. The mower don't seem to pick it up and chew it, so I'd rather have it standing so I can uh, push the mower through them. And it seems to shred them up a lot better. Probably in total, this is between half and three quarters of an acre of grass, and about half of it I managed to go over just the once, but uh, the other half I had a double cut. Um, as you can see, it's pretty long grass. Um, one thing, if you're cutting in long grass, especially this time of year, uh, I would suggest you don't wear shorts as we're very much in tick season and um, you can get some nasty things off them so uh, just be a little bit careful if you're in long grass
I did actually break the job down into sections so it didn't seem quite so daunting and that's half done now so we got the easy half now I did actually do this job the opposite way to a normal lawn in respect I mowed first then strimmed as I do have a habit of over strimming strimming too much so I decided I was going to mow everything first and get as much done as I can with the mower and that did actually eliminate quite a lot of strimming once I'd done the strimming I went once round the outside with the mower just to uh, break up any bits that the strimmer threw out I mowed all this with the mount field uh, 20 inch uh, it's got the Honda engine uh, but as you see I really discharged it all uh, but I have, have actually got a uh, Oregon gator blade on it mulching blade and I because I knew I was doing this I did freshly sharpen that blade as well and all the moment's done And there it is all done. And the sun's out as well. Thank you for watching and uh, hope you enjoyed. Thank you.